Spring is the busiest time of year for buying and selling homes in New Hampshire, and with a 20,000 unit shortage, listings were going fast until just recently. So that continued up until this weekend when most brokerages shut down open houses, and it seems like across the board everybody's trying to do as much virtual as possible. Ryan Vizda, owner of Vizda Realty Group in Concord, says she started doing virtual staging and tours, along with supplying rubber gloves, booties, and wipes, and only allowing one showing at a time. One of Ryan's listings belongs to Robin Mungin, who has already moved out and needs to sell. I think people will be comfortable coming here as if they know they're the only, you know, people looking at it at that moment. The New Hampshire Association of Realtors recently did a survey posing this question to its members. How has the coronavirus impacted your business in the past seven days? Responses included 12% of sellers removing their home from the market, postponing bringing new listings to the market, 52%, and 64% of buyers deciding to delay their home search. The only people entering the market are going to be those that really need to sell. COVID-19 is clearly having an effect on the industry, but the New Hampshire Association of Realtors tells me the actual financial impact won't be known for months. In Concord, Jason King, WMUR News 9.